Hey, what is up guys? It's your boy Rashad back at Invoke Pro and I'm extremely excited to share this with you guys. I have partnered up with XS Motorworks here on his Tesla Roadster project. Guys, as you can see from this graphic here that I have on screen, as you can see there's a Model S drive unit on the ground there. There's some type of custom frame in the backdrop, some type of engine. I don't know what it's for. Looks like a freaking Ford Coyote. And there's a sick mock-up of looks like a supercar. Guys, what in the world must I be up to? Haha, -ha, from the title you guessed it. I am teaming up with XS Motorworks for his Tesla roadster project build guys i'm going to jump right into let him introduce himself uh right now all right hey guys it's brian and welcome back to my shop so this is going to be episode number eight of project split decision so where we left off in episode seven is i hadn't actually created this frame so i went ahead and made a complete mirror copy of the frame and now i'm starting the process of actually go ahead and mounting this tesla motor what we need though to get this tesla going or get this body going is some batteries and that's where this comes in so if you see behind me, I got a bolt, and I actually happened to meet this guy named Rashawn. And Rashawn, why don't you come on in? <laughs> and Rashawn actually had just finished up an electric build on a, a motorcycle, an electric motorcycle build. So I kind of actually said, hey, you want to be a part of the project? And he's like, for sure. And so I have no idea how to t deal, deal with this bolt. So I've kind of actually, it's going to be on his channel. Why don't you go ahead and tell him what we're going to do over there? Hey, what is up, guys? It's Rashad from Invoke Pro. Uh, and right now, I just completed a Zero DS motorcycle rebuild project so with that project I essentially bought a uh, electric motorcycle off Copart in which I put it back together uh, made sure all the components function and uh, I was able to get a working motorcycle from nothing so I believe that uh, I have a little bit of experience experience with uh, electric bikes and we're gonna get this uh, battery module put in split decision and we're gonna get it up and running and we're gonna show you guys the whole project so we're really excited about that me and Brian are gonna team up and get that together for you yeah so what I'm gonna do is I will continue to actually do the build on the actual car on this channel and the actual strip down of the vault and the components and that process is actually going to be on his channel and I'll go ahead and link that in the description so uh, stay tuned and uh, let's go ahead and get cracking with Brian we're up under the Chevy vault right now we're gonna uh, get the mounts loose so we can drop this battery and some of our uh, plan of attack here there's about uh, 12 maybe what 10 bolts Brian that are holding the battery in so we're gonna lower the car put some blocks on it to catch that battery because it's about 400 or so pounds and then once we get it out of the car uh, it's gonna be project uh, split decision time and uh, but yeah we're gonna bring you guys along for the ride we got some time-lapse footage so you can see I did the uh, low voltage uh, the high voltage shutdown procedure to make sure this battery is safe to operate right now uh, but with it being sit for so long we should be safe to operate on but we did the procedures and we're gonna go ahead and start tearing it down now so stay, stay tuned guys We got that battery out super fast. Uh, go and check out my Instagram uh, page at Invoke Pro underscore. Uh, guys, I'm going to be doing a full uh, live coverage on the Instagram page if you want to keep up with the videos uh, and pictures of what we do as we continue to complete it very, very rapidly. Um, and this is just a picture of what was left of the Chevrolet Volt. We have a lot of parts left on there to scrap off. Like, for instance, on the next video, I'm going to be going through how we're going to get this battery to charge. We want to test it to make sure that all the cells are good in working condition. And uh, we're just going to be, you know, working this thing out, you know, as fast as we can guys to get this project on the road so if you like what you see and would like to subscribe please follow me on instagram at invoke pro and check me out on here on youtube like and subscribe invoke pro out